so they'll be calling you a radical so here I should be doing more of these videos the history here so I was I worked on Wall Street I worked on the CBOE boy I could trade options of futures like no other this is where I learned how when I was a boy I've been trying to buy this building and save this building it's one of the most important buildings in the western United States Ogden are fucking derelicts they won't play ball. I tried and tried to buy it. I've tried to preserve it. After it's Leslie Hodson masterpiece in this, the old Coliseum that used to sit right there was plum full of incredible artifacts. This was, you, I mean, you're talking one of the most important buildings in the world was right here. They let it burn down. So bad son, good son, east of Eden on Balco on chemo. So I was the bad son, which was really the good son, Dwayne Blanche, my dad, he had two boys and i was that one. Oh boy was i that one you know whoo -hoo, me and nikki brownie whoo -hoo -hoo. oh i had several of those but i learned to trade cattle futures in this building i watched people carry suitcases of cash in here in the 60s and 70s i made you know if you've ever read the end of east of eden remember when he made the big score in the futures market where i learned Go ask the legendary finance professor, Clyde Cooley. I taught the derivative class at Weber State for years. I'm headed up there right now to the game to do the play-by-play -play because we had to go rogue because they're trying to get kill media in Utah. That's Rashid. Josh Davis needs 40 yards to go over 3,000. So I did the play-by-play -play for years, but they've killed the radio, so they're trying to get rid of media. Well, I got a YouTube camera, so fuck them. And so... The history of this building and here it sits all these years still i want you to compare architecture and think about all the leslie hodson masterpieces they have tore down and i fought to save i saved the 1905 masonic temple with my mind and my arm and my back i hung from a rope seven days a week 12 hours a day for four months sit by myself by myself, not a crew of exploited labor, and I hand chiseled it, plastered, it couldn't be done. It couldn't be done, oh, I did it. That was his first, he was 21 years old. They tried to tear it down. I'm like, you cannot tear it down. Bernie Allen, Randy Richards bought it, and then they promised to put a plaque, of course, just like the tree in the Children's Museum. I, that's my work. The interior's all plath and plaster, that's mine, Kevin Blanche. Oh, we'll put a plaque up, sure, they, and I did it for free, so you know. I donated it. By the way, Godfrey was the mayor when I did that and Randy and Bernie paid me in cash, you know, 70000 which it should have been three times that, you know, because I want to save Ogden. I want to do my part. I want to give myself away, which I have. West Ogden, oh, this place used to be something else is all I got to say. Ho, ho, ho. There were more animals slaughtered here. How swiftly. They tore down the Swift building. Remember? Oh, he was a free market guy. Had a store full of toxic waste why would why the god would ogden buy that it was a super site they bought it and then had to fork out all the money to clean it up look at this this is disgraceful i've been trying to save it for decades i fought for it it's disgraceful you know i think it's his best i think it's leslie hot's best it's my favorite the pigs, the horse, the four up in top, the sheep. There's four missing. I know where they went. Oh, I know who stole them. I know who stole them. I can tell you a story about that. Criminal crooks. What they have done is disgraceful. So up to the game today in the Marine Biology Bowl. Get this out, Kev. This is an important video. I brought this for a reason. It's if you can find it. One man, after all these years, Blanche, you're still holding your old camera, you know. So I got my Weber State wallet. What's in that Weber State wallet? All my marine biology cards. Kevin Blanche, the marine biologist in the desert of Utah. Get them out. It's historic. I don't think I can. You can. God, can you believe after all these years, it's Kevin Blanche fighting this on his own. Holding his own camera. No publicists. There's all my marine biology cards up and down the coast of California. God, there's my lucky two. Oh, my New York City library card. My Bolonzo, Italy. 
la 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 What Weber State NFL? Yeah. <laughs> I'll get Jay to sign it. I'll donate it to the school because that's all I do is give myself away. The moose story this week doesn't prove to you what a disgrace the media is in this place. I don't know what. But so I used to trade cattle futures in there. That's where I learned. And then we would go over to the where the municipal well the court building is now. Used to be in where Ted Bundy was on the 13th floor in jail. That beautiful Leslie Hotman, 2550. You know, the Elks, the beautiful yellow masterpiece. So she worked there. We played poker all night. Oh my God, her and I together. Ooh. So, ooh. So that's another story how I met her in high heels, shotgunning a beer. Woo! So anyway, that was Ogden, right? The great Freudian city. Ask Mama K. Brody. Ask Bernard DeVoto, the great Freudian city. How could I not be Freudian growing up in this city? Are you kidding me? The boxes, matches that were right there. I mean, the history of this place is incredible. The concrete troughs are still here. I've been looking at these for years. I'm like, what are you going to do with them? What are you going to do with them? You can throw them away. I'll take them. I want them. I'd like to make a piece of art out of them. Wouldn't it be a great piece of art? I mean, we could do some sculptures. The horses, none. The hell with the horses. We need the pig, the goat, cow, the horse. This is such an incredible, but the tile work, the mosaics that are inside there were, and look what they let it to happen. Look at this architecture. I want you to compare that architecture to that. It's a disgrace. I mean, it's a disgrace to Leslie Hodson. It's a disgrace to the old Ogdenites. It's a disgrace to, I mean, it's an absolute fucking disgusting. There used to be the Pillsbury Tower right there. It was red and white checkered. They recently tore that down. This place is cool as hell down here. Chemical waste site now there. Right, this is, I'm standing right here where the old, I remember. Well, I shouldn't tell that story. I won't. So I did the restoration on the old. I got in trouble when I was young, okay? As a kid, I did some dumb shit. I was 24, 25 years old, so. The judge ruled that I had a few hundred, Judge Brown, he gave me a hun, few hundred hours of community service, hundreds of hours, you know? It wasn't nothing violent, anything, just drinking related, I was wild. So, I come over here, and he says, well, I'll tell you what, I'll trade off all these hours if you point in and do all the restoration on this plaster on the one area on the Coliseum. You got a deal, let's shake on it. Dave Boyston, we shook on it. Well, I came in here with my crew. <laughs> I own Blanche Plaster, and those days I started Plaster in 16. Have you ever seen me go to the Hawkins to Blow your mind, not the fake shit. We did it in two days. And he says, well, that's, we, I can't check it. I says, the deal's a fucking deal. You shook on it. That's the way it was in here. It was in cash. People would bring suitcases. I saw millionaires made and lost daily in here. Huh. Used to be eating on Balco, huh. on chemo. Huh. George, I can let me tend them ravages. Huh. George Steinbeck, the Freudian writer. You ever read Cannery Row? That would be tagged as hate speech today, Cannery Row. Freaking Mice and Men would be hate speech. Freaking classic literature. Edward Abbey, who I knew personally in this town, who was married to a girl from Kazoo who died of leukemia. Don't tread on the Queen's Forest. It's disgusting. It's disgusting. Caldwell, I saw him at the store the other day, and I just shook my head at him. Godfrey, I mean, it's one criminal mayor after another. You know, I, I worked for Mayor Madsen. I knew him personally. The first Mayor Madsen, not the second one. That, that was Meekum that went to prison, not Madsen. Mayor Meekum went to prison. Mayor Madsen, uh, he was a gym. Madsen Furniture, I did all that plaster. Now it's Weber State's building. I did all that plaster work for him. You know how much Mayor Madsen paid himself? Nothing. Like Alexander Hamilton. So, it's disgraceful. Oh, it pisses me off. I've been fighting to save this building since the freaking 
early 90s. I tried to, tried to buy it. La, 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 la. Where's your soup can? I guess we'll have to soup. We'll have to flip the football. Let's punt it. <laughs> Remember when I met Jim McMahon right over the first time? You know Jim McMahon was a punter. Oh, you want to talk an athlete? I met him right over here in the Roy Park. You know, on, that's where I knew, same place where I first met Luann Bambro. Hung herself with the orange. Mick Jagger's girlfriend. I love how the media says that. She was so much more than that. Legs this tall. That first picture that got her recognized and made her the great fashion designer or whatever the model was in front of a Leslie Hodson. She was sitting right there where I do all that, the old Deseret Gym. Oh, what a master. Oh, that's bacon. That's bacon. Should we punt it? Pick up your cards, Kev. No measure. So, the Marine Biology Bowl today, Weber State, UC Davis. You know, there are a bunch of Fukushima deniers on Budoka Bay. Not Kevin Blanche. I do all the work down there. I have done all the work. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. I want you. <laughs> mm, it's the only song I like in the last 20 years. What a masterpiece that is. And a time when there is no it's lighting. All we hear is Radio Goo Goo. Radio Gaga. How do you think she got that name? I mean, there's an artist. She's still an artist. I love her work. You know, Avant Garde on Balco and Chemo. So, where'd you get this? Weber State, NFL. They got a bunch of players that should be in the NFL of this team this year. I've been there the whole time. So, the Marine Biology Bowl. <laughs> Who's the Marine Biologist? Honestly. Play back the tape, Your Honor. Kevin Blanche, the Marine Biologist in the High Desert of Utah. I mean, I remember Clyde Cooley, University of Chicago guy. Kind of like Fama K. Brody, who was born here. You're the most brilliant freaking derivative arbitrage freaking you can do. The devil form you in your head. I have the last letter of recommendation when we were the number one school business in the United States at Weber State. Not now. Don't go see the Dalai Lama. La, 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 la. la, la. Where can we lean this up? I don't know. So, Jim McMahon was a punter. I remember the first time I met him in the park. He's punting. Had his sunglasses on then. Jim McMahon has a missing eye. Did you know that? That's why the sunglasses. Think about how great he was with one eye. Oh my God, what an athlete. He, and then the first time I saw him punt, I'm like, holy shit. But we used to play in the park. Oh my God, what an athlete. So he goes to BYU as the punter. <laughs> if you think about it, and quarterback gets hurt. I think that was 1980. So think about it. He becomes the quarterback.